Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel. And a um, couple of questions that came through for Windows 10. Uh, one of them, of course, you guys know that uh, there's a new backup app that was actually um, introduced in Windows 10. And of course, the question is, well, why do they do this if Windows 10 is not getting any new features? This is kind of a new feature. Yeah, it's, it's you know, the way that it works, um, it's not getting new features necessarily, but there's little things here and there. Another thing that some have seen with this backup app, by the way, is that the File Explorer, when you go to the File Explorer, some of them will see soon a backup icon here on the uh, right side of the uh, ribbon here. So uh, it's not there yet. It is in the Windows 10 operating system though if uh, you use the Vive tools there's a way to activate it right away that tells you that this is going to add something to file explorer so you know they're tweaking here and there uh, about these uh, new little things but don't expect to have too many of these uh, in the near future now somebody said is that a indication that windows 10 might actually be um uh, going past beyond the, um, you know, October 2025 end of support. We don't know. We're not there yet. And we're still, you know, roughly two years away. It's uh, two years. I'll say it again. It's a very long time in, in computer and PC and tech world. So, um, you know, we're going to see. And if it does have an extension, I don't think that will be announced, you know, much more before really, really getting very close to but for now, um, it's not happening. The um, future of Windows 10 also concerning uh, security. I get that question regularly. If someone on the channel said the friend of his told him that Windows 10 was not as secure as Windows 11, that you had to move on, and that's why he had moved on to Windows 11. You know, that's the Microsoft mumbo-jumbo. When did you not hear Microsoft say that the latest Windows is always the greatest Windows? It always the most secure Windows? It's the same rhetoric every new operating system. I don't see any reason for somebody on Windows 10 that is happy with his machine to move on to Windows 11, honestly. It's a great system. I love it. But you know what? If you love Windows 10 and you're happy, hey... You're fine. Just continue using. Still got two years. You'll have two years to decide what's going to happen next. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe. Give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.